Well, hello, first grade. This is a harmonica. It makes music. And it's one of my new hobbies, because I don't have much else to do. All right, let's get started. It's time for another remote learning math lesson with Mr. Enzi, I'm going to shrink myself into the corner. Today, we are going to continue to combine shapes. And when we combine shapes, when we put shapes together, we compose a new shape. Let's try. Here I have a triangle. And I have another triangle. I want to put the triangles together to make a new shape. So let's see. Oh, I can turn, oh, I can put my triangles like that. I made a new shape. My triangles don't overlap and they don't leave many big spaces. They kind of connect side to side. The new shape that I made is called a rhombus. We actually call this the fat rhombus because it's wide. This rhombus here is called the skinny rhombus. So you might see some of those words, skinny rhombus, fat rhombus, and then the triangles make a fat rhombus. See that? Pretty cool. Let me see if I can make a shape with hmm, a trapezoid and a square. Hmm, let's see. Trapezoid and a square. Ah, well, there we go. I made a new shape. I don't know the name of its shape. Maybe it's the, oh, it's the Renzinator. That looks like a good shape. I could also take my square and make the shape look like that. Pretty cool. I'm composing new shapes. Let's see if I can get a harder one. Hmm, this time I want to use a hexagon, a triangle, and a trapezoid to make a new shape. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I like that. And maybe, oh my goodness, it looks like a rocket ship. The rocket shape. Looking good. Let's try one more. Hmm, let's see. This time I have a square, another square, a triangle, another triangle, and a rhombus. And I have to put all of these together to make one shape. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, let's see. Oh, I like. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, let me see if I can. Oh, look at that shape. It almost looks like a snake. The snake shape. So today, you are going to be using some 2D objects, and you're going to combine some of those objects to make a shape. You are going to compose new shapes. All right, my first grade mathematicians, you're going to head into Seesaw, and you're going to try to compose new shapes. We'll see everybody real soon. I can't wait to see your shape creations.